Their so-called Minister of Defense states that the evidence of the massacre in Kyiv region is fake, created by USA. Their so-called Ministry of Foreign Affairs states that their troops are angels. But their so-called media continue to demand more massacre, murders and genocide of the whole Ukrainian nation. No Marshall Plan is available for these territories, no neutrality. Denazification should be the decriminalization. Apart from the authorities, a large part of their people are guilty. Their passive Nazis support Nazism. So Russians, as always, took their own model and blamed Ukraine for it. While almost 80% of Russians support murders and massacre in Ukraine, they have enough cynicism to accuse the country they invaded in their own paranoia. They do create distorted picture of the world around them. Here, for example, the difference between search engines. What Google shows you if you search Bucha. And what Russian Yandex shows you. This is the main difference between Russians and Nazis 80 years ago. Russians are too coward to admit that they murder, rape and steal. Generations are fed with the covertness and the ugly ideology of their own superiority over the world. And it would be understandable if they would stay with it behind a huge fence and a ditch. But they are not. This is Crete, the biggest island in Greece, European Union. Russians went on march in support of the war in Ukraine. They support massacre in Bucha, bombs in Mariupol, Kharkiv, killing, raping and looting on the territory of the Union that stands for democracy values. This example is not a unit. Russians just adore dates even when they don't understand their meaning. And they are getting prepared for the next one, 9th of May, the so-called Victory Day, the date when they think they won the Second World War. They will wear the symbols of their armed looters and go on the streets of European cities, drunk, savage, dangerous. They will go on the streets of Berlin also, they already do. Well, it's better than 10 years old tradition of beating German tourists in Turkish hotels. 